All right. So today, I'm going to take you guys and just go for a bike ride. Uh, unfortunately, these two bikes, my favorite bikes, uh, my 907 fat bikes are sort of out of commission right now. This one has a bad bottom bracket, and that one's just basically full of sand from my weekend at Sand Mountain. Plus, I broke something on my Ren fork. So anyway, today, I'm decided to take the trail bike out and ride a little street. Here we go. Kind of cool, little stick forest in the woods. If you follow me on Instagram, this is usually what you get lately because I haven't been filming that much, but I always like to snap a photo of where I've been, what I'm doing. If you guys want, you can follow me along there. It's at Dan underscore Arbuckle. Put a link in the description if you're interested. Oh, I'm trying to block the jump here. Morning. Pretty awesome. It's kind of a side of Lodi most people don't get to see. Sandy, we were pretty lucky to have this right in our backyard. Five minute bike ride from the house. No Moab, but gets me out. Oh, <laughs> crash right on the camera, and I think it killed it. it. Wasn't even that bad. As soon as I hit the front brakes to make the pivot, down we went. <laughs> oh. So if you've watched many of my videos, 
you've definitely seen this spot. One of my favorite spots to ride. They're just a perfect bike gap apart. That was about as terrible as I've done it, but first time on a trail bike, so what do you expect? I think it could work. Let's give it a wiggle. All right, here we go on attempt number two here. Better that time. So I don't do a whole lot of trials on my trail bike. When I do, I always have a good time, but it takes a day or two to sort of get used to the feeling of the suspension, get everything dialed in. But once you play with it, it's actually really fun, a whole different way to ride. So right there, I got up on the bench and side hopped up, but I don't know, I feel good. I may or may not have it in me to get up all the way. Not the first try. I think I should have that though, you guys. Let's go for attempt number two. All right, we're gonna give this a try again. Got to commit to getting my whole bike up there. Woo! What is this? I don't know how he was going into the plus size game. 26 by 3 0s. Might be my next bike right there. <laughs> so I don't know if you guys have been watching any of uh, Ollie Clarkson's blog. If you're not, you should. But he's been throwing down on a trail bike lately. You know, him, Danny McCaskill, Chris Ackig, all those guys. Super impressed me with what they can do on these trail bikes. Uh, so they sort of inspire me to come out and try more things. I'll put the link to uh, those two descriptions, Chris Ackig and uh, Ollie Clarkson in the, in the link. If you haven't seen Danny McCaskill already and you're watching this video, Dude, you're living under a rock. Man, I'm pretty stoked on this thing. Like, if you can hit it with a little bit of momentum, it's amazing. Yeah, so fun. All right, so if you guys that are wondering about my setup, here's my bike. It's a Specialized Stump Jumper 27.5 Plus. I think it was like their comp. But as you can see, I've sort of went through and reworked a lot of the bike. This is kind of fun to show you guys my local stomping grounds. I mean, when I have an hour or two away from the kids and away from work, this is where I like to ride. This lake leads out into the river, so people will launch here and then take their boats up river. A lot of kayaks and canoes and paddle boards out here these days. This is actually where I learned how to paddle when I was like seven. So if you want to get good at riding trials, the number one tip I have, ride skinnies and track stand. Helps you focus on your vision, your body control, your awareness, all that stuff's so important. Some of the only single track we have in Lodi, so it'd be a shame to miss it, right? So fun. <laughs> right. Yeah. 
that worked. Wasn't sure I was gonna be able to get enough speed for that one. All right, guys, that pretty much concludes it. That's my one lap around Lodi Lake. Appreciate you guys watching. If you haven't done so already, jump down there, click on the icon for the subscribe button. Check out some of the other videos. Leave us a comment. Click the thumbs up. Connect. We appreciate you guys following along. It's always fun to shred with you. Until next time, man.